Hey my you, you know where I watch Dance out. Blessed Sunday to each and every one We are going dance our skill day again, you see it? Yeah, big up and respect to each and every one, alright? Man has our respect Alright, so in this video, I'm going to present to you videos that are being talked about on social media I don't know where and exactly when these videos are being recorded But I present these videos to you, look and tell me what you think about these videos as well, viewers and subscribers, alright? Now first things first I am going to present a video to you that's going to show a man And in the video, the man said some things that gave me the understanding that he said that he's looking for a wife now, I questioned some of the things that the man said in the video of viewers and subscribers because I wonder if the video is a publicity stunt or not. You see? And I would like you, my viewers and subscribers, to tell me what to think about this video as well. You see? You can tell me if you believe or if you don't believe some of the things that the man said in this video. And I'm going to tell you what I think as well about some of the things that the person said in the video. Alright? Anyways, here's the video. Look, listen, observe and tell me what you think. Good morning, everybody. My name is Reverend Dr. Randall B. Gillett. I'm out here at this moment telling all single women who know the word of God that I'm looking for a wife. If that's you, leave me a private comment. Amen. And to all those who are responding back, let's use scripture, okay? That's your opinion. The Bible says in Proverbs, he that finds a wife finds a good thing, finds favor in God. So that means I have to look. So at this moment, I'm using TikTok to find a wife. God has blessed us with wisdom to use social media. So that's what I'm doing at this moment. So if God touched you to get contact with me, get contact with me. Amen. God bless you. My people, a social media is here. And everything you see and hear on social media, you believe. You hear me? I said to you, it's not everything you see and hear on social media you should believe. Now, if this man really and truly mean the things that he said in the video, well, what can I say? I mean, if if he really and truly mean the things that he said, then at least he asks. You see me? I said, yeah, because you have some people who not trying none at all. But at the same time, I wonder if that man married. I wonder if that man have a wife. I wonder, I'm not saying, I'm wondering if he married or if he have a wife. I wonder if he have some form of companion. You see me, I say? Yeah, man, so on everything you see on here on social media, you must believe yours and subscribers because what if the man do that video as a, some form of publicity stunt to get views and likes on social media? You tell me now, see? Yeah, man. Yeah, you may tell me what you think, but people. You can tell me if you believe or if you don't believe him. I'm going to move on to another topic. Now, I am going to present a video to you that's going to show some things that happened after a man ate a certain amount of pepper or peppers. You see it? Yeah, according to information that I got, I got the understanding that the video shows some things that happened after the man ate a certain amount of peppers. See? And if you listen carefully to the video, you might get an understanding as to how many peppers the person might have ate. You see? There was some form of liquid or fluid coming from the man's eyes that can be considered to be tears you see what i'm saying to your viewers and subscribers you can also hear persons talking in the background of the video see now before i present this video to you my viewers and subscribers i want to say this to each and every one do not do any form of pepper eating challenge don't make any bet with anyone that you can eat a certain amount of peppers without any food or water don't do it. Peppers can be dangerous to your health depending on how you use peppers. See me? Because I know so there are many countries out there worldwide that use peppers as a seasoning or to cook food as well, some people might say. See me? I say. But eating peppers alone by itself can be very dangerous to your digestive system. It's no joke. See? Now, before I present this video to you, this is a warning that some of the scenes in this video might not be suitable for everyone. Viewer, description is advised. Here's a video. Look, listen, observe, and tell me what you think. Water, water. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, boom, yeah, <laughs> I sweet, I cool, I sweet. Pepper do that, yeah? No, I cool, squeeze. 
Yo, yo, look, 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 <laughs> hey, <father>. <laughs> <laughs> Sir, my room. Tell you Yeah, yeah. Yo, you are crazy here, Tell you man. Boom, boom. 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 Jesus Christ! Jack, Jack, you're close here, Jack. What's the thing that you doing? Multi-jack. Alright. Listen, so far, this is a boy. If people don't eat that content, not tough like this. I don't have to say people don't eat. You don't feel that content. Where? Yo, you eating that body? You can't feel it. A tree pepper man just niam. My people, you ever hear anyone say the same way something going is the same way it might come out? Hot going in, hot coming out. Eh? You never hear nobody say that before. And I think it is common knowledge by now that grown adults know that peppers can damage your digestive system. It can be harmful to your body. You can eat three, four, five peppers and feel like a psycho. A joke thing that that can hurt you. You might be surprised to know. You understand? But... I only can give advice. I can't force anybody to do what is right. Guess what I say? It's up to a person what they want to do with his or her body. But I tell you, peppers are a joking thing, my people. Anyways, my people, now, I'm going to move on to another video, my viewers and subscribers. Now, the next video that I'm about to present to you is going to show two persons playing a type of game you see me now i'm not sure what those persons who was playing that game call that game you see me but it depends on which country that you live in that some persons might call the game a draft or another type of game you see what i'm saying to you now i am not sure but during the game i see where one of those persons made a move that i think might have been a unfair move maybe but i would like you my viewers and subscribers to look at the video and tell me if you think any of those persons cheated while playing the game you can also tell me what's the name of the game that those two persons was playing as well to viewers and subscribers all right anyways here's the video look listen observe and tell me what you think <laughs> Watch carefully in the time I move past. Look. Look. Watch. Alright, watch carefully now. Look carefully now. Just look. It will come to a party. Look. Look at this. Look at this. Oh, that happened. <laughs> This is the other one. Hold on. This is the other one. 
This whole point at all. Just give me a go and let the game finish first. I'll make the video finish first. Yeah, yeah. Alright, now my people, I'm going to look right here so, on the screen now. I'm going to slow down this part a little bit. See? Now, look at this right here. Tell me if this was a fair move right here. See? Look, you know, look carefully. Notice me slow it down a little. Right? Was that a fear move? Look. Look. Was that a fear move? Eh? You tell me now, my people. See, because in my point of view, me don't see the right amount of steps where that cannot, me don't see how that really and truly fear. But maybe, maybe them play that game different. I don't know. You know, maybe them play the game different. But me don't think that was a fear move. Straight up and down, my people. I don't know how to explain it because I don't know how some people might call that game or call certain things. I don't know if that's how they play that game. But I don't think that's a fair move. You see, today are Sunday, my people. I don't really and truly want to talk about no crime and violence in this video right here. You see, I say this is a, you know, a video about certain videos that are being talked about on social media. Alright, anyways, my people, no. Alright, now I'm going to present another video to you, my viewers and subscribers, and I would like you to listen to some things that a man said in this video that I'm about to present to you. I would like you to tell me if you agree or if you disagree with the things that the man said in this video. And I'm not going to explain the things that the man said in this video, viewers and subscribers. I think it would be best that you look and listen to this video for yourself. So may I say, oh, and please bear in mind that you can hear harsh language in this video. So viewer discussion is advised. Observe. And tell me what you think. Why is it most Jamaican mothers try to turn them daughters and them, them sons, them children on a whole, against them father? Mm. And try to convince them children, say, them as the mother is it, and your father and nothing. Even when the father is there 100%. With the children, them with the family, I take care of them. Listen, listen. I, 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 I see a certain situation where this this young lady is doing her utmost best to convince her children them over the years. The picture them all big woman now and big man now, and them is of the belief that them father and their mother is it. Their mother is everything, and them father and nothing. You know, so that. No fear mm -hmm. because some of the children they might grow up and understand say right they know say mommy I keep up listen but you know say you have some children who are very stupid who grow up and believe so what you know believe in what their mother say and believe in the operation of their mother and realize say and feel say daddy and nobody even when daddy they right a yard they grew up with them right now the same home from them born till them a big smuddy. Hmm. Hmm. It's a very tough thing, you know. And because of that, and you know, so that's one of the main reasons why you say Mother's Day is so jubilant and Father's Day come like and nothing. Yeah, because the mother them I try to convince the children them. Hmm. Say, them father not love them or them father not this or them father not that or them mother do everything. That's why I convince all of them father and you know, me take this from me, you know, brother. You see, as soon as you pick me up sense, mm -hmm. stop giving mama them the money and give the pick me them that money. Okay. Give the pick me the money and I'm making you say I give you money from you young from you have sense. As soon as you have sense, start putting money in there or anything we do for them. Do it yourself. <laughs> buy what you buy for them yourself. Because them mama has some wicked mama, you know. Then they write in the house, in the family settings with you as a father, you know, and I convince the people them say, you, wow. you are not nobody, you, you don't do nothing, mm -hmm. and I them do everything. You know, say a grudgeful <sighs> and bad mind cause a dirty mind, covetous mind, your grudge your man for him pick me, and a few on him pick me, and you him make the pick me, and it's as if you don't want the man for feel like say man know nobody and the pick me feel like say at the moment is everything and the father and nothing. You know if you stop it 
We don't want to stop it. Well, my people, I can really and truly say that in some cases, you have some mothers who really and truly say some negative things about uh, the fathers to the children. And I really see, we have good women out there, really and truly, um, you know, where now we do them kind of things. Eh? Yeah, I have, have to defend those good ones. Yeah, man, I tell you the truth. You have, have to defend them good ones there. You see, me, me now go just fry everybody in a one pot. You see? Yeah, but the thing of vice versa too, you know. Because you have uh, some fathers who will say negative things about the female as well too. You see me? But on a real though, I think that this man might have a point there. You know? Because certain things I don't really think about. And on a real, I don't have to tell you lie. If the man says certain things in the video, I start to look at certain things and he might, he might have a good point. Maybe. You know what I mean? I don't discredit him. I'm not real. But it's, it's rough. It's really rough, my people. It's rough. It's rough. It's rough. Mm. Well, anyways, tell me what you think, my people. Tell me if you agree or if you disagree or what you think about the things that the man said in the video, my people. Because I'm not real. I want the heavy. Yeah man, I want the heavy, 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 heavy. Now, before I end this video, viewers and subscribers, I want to listen to some things that a musician who goes by the name of Merchandise said in a video, viewers and subscribers. See? Yeah, more check out his YouTube channel. Observe. Listen and tell me what you think. Awesome. You know, say, I hear you, Merchandise. I'm here to listen more to people and go check out Merchandise YouTube channel. Mm -hmm. You can find me. I spell it M I R C H. A N D I C E. Check me out right now on YouTube. Like, share, and subscribe. I have a few things more on the item. Go check out. You understand? And show me support. Leave a comment. You understand? I'm mean, going to say right now that you can dance and still have to say big him up. Alright, merchandise, big up yourself. Yeah, merchandise, big up yourself. You see what I say? Yeah, my people, go check out him YouTube channel. Is it? Yeah, make him know what you think about the music. Alright, and um, you can make him know that I'm missing him. You see me ask some people. Yeah, man, that's a skiller channel is a place where your voice can be heard, whether you're a musician or not. You see me ask some people. So, you know, go check out him YouTube channel and big him up. You see? Anyways, I have some other left it now. Big up and respect to each and everyone. Until the next time, my name is Dance Skiller. Big up yourself, is it? Hey, my you, you know where you watch. Dance Skiller! Yeah, man. Hey, yo, Skiller! You are watching Dance on Skillet. Tin. Dance on Skillet.